Well, hi, and welcome to Coffee with Chris. It is Wednesday, March 22nd. We are the front porch located at 24 South Main Street in downtown Pennington, New Jersey. And I am once again, just really, really happy to be with you. Um, hope everybody had a wonderful weekend last weekend. Uh, I think I mentioned to you that uh, we were off uh, Saturday night uh, headed to the Poconos up with two dear friends of ours, uh, Ginger and Brendan. Went up there, uh, went to uh, this wonderful club on Lake Naomi and celebrated uh, <laughs> St. Patrick's Day with a lot of wonderful food, drink, and crazy people in the wonderful color of green. So it's... it's uh, it's always a lot of fun, whether you are Irish or not. On St. Patrick's Day, everyone is Irish. Okay, so let's talk about <laughs> what's happening here. And um, it's just crazy. It really is. Uh, yesterday, Karen and I met with another person, another company, and we're ordering Christmas. <laughs> and you're sitting there thinking to yourself, oh my gosh. It's <laughs> March is almost over. Where the heck is everything going? But just enjoy every minute, right? Okay, so just a couple of things. Uh, just a reminder, we still have our stationary sale on. We still have our invitation. And that's just invitation sale on. And of course, the wonderful uh, gift with purchase from Brighton, that beautiful tote that all you have to do is spend $150 and uh, you get that free tote. So there are just a few things happening. Now, I need to show you this. We just got these beautiful, uh, I think, I just, they're, they're, yes, okay, it's kind of a shawl, but it is a beautiful lightweight top. Here we have it in pink. Uh, Karen and I actually found it at a Made in America show. It caught Karen's eye. She had to have it. I just have to show you this. This would look wonderful with that little black dress or those little black pants. So we got this. We actually got it in four different colors. So we, for those pink girls, here we go. We've already started to sell these. We were very excited to find this, uh, this manufacturer for you purple girls. And then just so you know, you can either wear it with the V or take it and open it up. You can wear it both ways, but it is just very, very light. Uh, it would be great, let's say, if you're going to a wedding in a church and you've got a, a dress that's a little bit open, uh, this would be great to wear on top. And then, of course, last Friday, I had a green sweater on, and I know a lot of you like those green sweaters because uh, by four o'clock Friday afternoon, uh, they were all gone. So I think there are a lot of green people out there. I, and look at, uh, this is just gorgeous. And I really think that these colors would look fabulous on anyone. And last but not least, kind of the navy blue black. Uh, this is just beautiful. So thinking of something that you have happening over the next couple of months, this could be a really nice accent to that outfit. So keep that in mind. All right. Then the other item that we just got back in the house, and I know a lot of you like this, it's a company called Baked Beads and they do great birthstones. So I just, I'm just going to show you three months. We actually have every month and many times people don't buy a color just because it's their birthstone. They buy a color because they like it, or it just so happens that they have an outfit that it works perfectly with. So let me just show you the beautiful month of March. Beautiful month of April. And last but not least, May. But as I mentioned, we have January through December. So no matter what color you need or want, this is a really nice choice of a really beautiful earring. Uh, once again, made in the United States. 
then Karen and I were very happy to get this item back in the house. And since I'm standing back in what we call baby land, and of course behind me you can see all the wonderful jelly cat that we absolutely love. And just speaking about jelly cat, I'm not showing that today, but I did want to mention to you that Karen and I actually worked on the holiday pie for jelly cat. They have outdone themselves and um, probably come October and I'm not rushing it. You will start to see jelly cat holiday. All right. But what I am happy we got these wonderful baby blankets. They are just so soft, so wonderful. We got them back in pink. We have the white. And last but not least, we have blue. Very, very beautiful and just so wonderful. Kind of feels like a jelly cat, although it's not. And then, let me just show you this. Debbie did a sample for us of personalization, just so you can see this. And so it is just, there's nothing like adding a name to a blanket or a lovey. And of course our Debbie from Fancy Threads can do that very quickly for you. Usually have it back in the house next day. We don't like to put pressure on her, but sometimes, sometimes we do and she always rises to the challenge. Okay, then last but not least, uh, this is another company, I'm back in Babyland that does beautiful handmade sweaters. When we order them, uh, I mean, this time I think it took us about eight weeks to get the sweaters, but a very popular sweater for us has been this one with the alligator on the back. It's really gender neutral. You can give it to a boy or a girl, doesn't matter which one. Normally we carry these sweaters and we do have choices in 12 months. We don't even bother with <laughs> six months because they're in them for a heartbeat. So we buy six months. But then someone was going to, actually we've had a couple of special orders for the 2T size and the 3T size. So Karen and I thought about it and we thought, you know what, why don't we just have that available for our customers who want to just grab and go. So just so you know, this beautiful sweater now is available in 2T and 3T. So if you happen to have someone, it's, it's perfect weight for the weather we're about to get into and it's 100% cotton. So keep that in mind. All right, so let me just check here. I think I have talked about everything I need to. So I am just gonna wish you a wonderful rest of the day. Uh, it's supposed to get to be 60 here in, um, in Central Jersey, which is always great. I'm hoping to play golf tomorrow, but it might be in between raindrops. But have a good rest of the week, and we will see you on the next Coffee with Chris at 1230 on Friday. Have a wonderful rest of the week.